Hey everyone, I'm Jeff, and what a year it's been for video games, right? To close out 2016, I'm here to round up my favorite games of the year, of course, in no particular order. Now, I'm only going to mention five of my favorites here, so be sure to check out the full list over on CNET. So let's start things off with a no-brainer Uncharted 4. It's not easy living up to the hype, but this game actually did it. A great story, intense and compelling action sequences, and over-the-top production values obviously makes this one of 2016's best. And how about Doom, right? Doom's a game that had no business being good, but lo and behold, it's without a doubt one of the best shooters of the last five years. Now sure, the multiplayer mode wasn't really worth investing that much time in, but man, that campaign was epic. Speaking of surprises, I have to admit Titanfall 2's campaign was its own slice of brilliance too. While the original didn't have any single player mode, the one in Titanfall 2 actually outshines its multiplayer offerings. Okay, let's switch gears a little bit and talk about the indie games of 2016. I fell in love with the story and presentation of Firewatch, which hit back in February. Hello, Two Forks Tower. Um, hello? Whoever this is? It's Henry, right? A really unique art style combined with spectacular storytelling and fantastic performances by Rich Sommer and Sissy Jones made this one truly a memorable experience. And finally, I have to give some love to Inside. It's the follow-up to Limbo from the small team at Playdead. Inside was a dark and atmospheric side-scroller with a wonderfully bizarre story and style. Its puzzles were smartly designed and often terrifying, making this one a complete package well worth its price. So there you have it, some of my favorite games of 2016. There are plenty more to mention, so be sure to check out the full list over on CNET.